What's up guys, this is iTweets here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you a tweet called Defined for iOS 7. Now what this tweet does is give you the ability to look up a word in the dictionary, in the thesaurus, as well as on Wikipedia. So once you download it and install it, it actually installs CC Loader. So you can rearrange everything right here, but it's going to start right down here at the bottom. But if we go into the settings here, I'm going to show you if we scroll down to CC Loader, you can see that you can rearrange this however you want. So if you want it up at the top, then you can do that. If you want it under the media controls, which I actually have hidden right now, then you can do that as well. So we're going to put it right there, and we're going to open this up. And you can see right there where it says AA Dictionary is actually what you're going to tap on. So here you have the option to look up a word in the dictionary, look up something in Wikipedia, or in the thesaurus. So if we wanted to look up a word, let's just say we wanted to look up cold. You should know the definition of cold, but if you don't, then it's going to give it to you right there. You can also tap on this. It's going to open up for a more in-depth look. So we tap done here, and we tap this again. Now let's say we wanted to look up something in the thesaurus. Then we're going to do just that. So we're going to do cold again, tap on thesaurus, and here it is right here. So you have your main entry and synonyms right down there. So again, we can just tap this little X right down here at the bottom, and if we open this back up once again, we can actually look up something in Wikipedia. So let's just look up Civil War. And I noticed with this, it actually took a little bit longer to load up, as you can see right here. It just takes a few seconds, but once it loads up, there you have it. You can tap on, read up, whatever you want to in Wikipedia. So a pretty helpful tweet that's easily accessible right in the control center. So let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Alright guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.